Right, I'm here with Stevie Ward with his pound launch shades. What on earth's going on with these, mate? Bit of plastic, plastic shades for today. It's, it's sunny today, mate. I've lost me my, uh, my normal Ray Bans and it's, it's red hot, so I needed them. Looks like you've got them on now, pal. I'm, I'm saving them. We're here at best and we're uh, trying a bit of clobber on. This is the sort of style that Stevie Ward goes for. Being a Morley lad, you like the Morley, Morley mini cello. Um, <laughs> Nick Scruton, Ben K, Lee Smith. They're not known for the the dress sense. Are you somebody who likes a bit of fashion? Probably, uh, probably different to them, mate. I look at fashion, and you know, you, you, it's it's different to Smithy. And he, he's he's a bit oblivious to it all. He doesn't really know what's going on, and uh, he's here, then here, there, and everywhere, mate. And I'm just at best, and it's good that we're getting sorted out, mate. It's good good to see good to see if, what the experiment's like, and you know, wearing some of this gear, it's great. You know, it's uh, I suppose it's like sporty mixed with a bit of fashion, and it's a bit different than a best in Leeds. It's Leeds brand. It's brilliant, pal. Well, he's quite a good-looking kid anyway, so it's all right. It's worth dressing up, and it? It's not like Lee Smith. It's like dressing up a pumpkin with him, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Waste of time. But, uh, mate, you're having a fantastic season this year. I'm calling it Morley Minicello, because you remind me of, of Minicello. Ollo was just like a raging bull when he gets out of that ball at that back row on the edges there. What's been a big difference for you this season as opposed to previous years? You've really come to maturity, haven't you? Mate, I've, I've just had time to train. I've had a pre-season. Um, my shoulders have, have been there to be able to do weights and that. And I've been able to to, to actually do something pre season. All other pre seasons, I've had, had a shoulder up. I've I've been injured. I've missed training, and it's it's hard to take when you're not training because you you know it's it's tough and you're watching all the lads and they're getting better. They're getting stronger, and I'm there and I'm I'm playing as an 18 year old. When I look back now, as an 18 year old, I think how did I do it? You know, tackling some of them fellows that we play against now, and I just feel like I can cope better and, and turn out performances now and. It's just good, mate. It's just it's just good to be good to be there and be back fit and, and to I've only missed one game this year from just a little niggle, so so far it's going alright for me, mate. Would you say that the secret is down to the legs? Because you've got the biggest legs and backside in the uh, you don't remind me of him out of um Lightwitch up wardrobe, that like half man, half half basing. <laughs> I'd say yeah, I've I've got a you know, bit of mass down there and it's probably helped me out a lot. Especially with like I was saying when I was eighteen and you know, I looked at myself and my upper body is not really there, but I think I had the legs that, that, that could put up with it. Do you know what I mean? So I think having a good base for your legs and, and stuff like that, but obviously with the trouble I've had with my shoulder, um, you, you know, you, you want to be back big up top as well. And hopefully I've, I've done a bit better on, on that on that scale of things as well. <laughs> You're enjoying the season, mate. There's a real opportunity for you to get involved in winning some trophies, play at Wembley, everything for play for, isn't it? Gone finals. Yeah, yeah, mate. It's 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 awesome. You know, especially being top at ladder now. You know, there thereabouts, and we've got Saints this Friday, so it, it's great to be up there. And 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 something we've lacked over the last few years is consistency, isn't it? Uh, so I think if 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 we can stay consistent throughout the year and and, and keep beating the big teams. You know, I think we win with a good chance and Leeds are always in with a good chance, but with the group we've got this, this year, you know, we used to come back into it, mate, we'll, we'll be sweet. Have you been in that ETS squad yet, you? Have you been, have you been named in that? Uh, I, I went to um, a little bit of a meeting the other day. Oh, did you? <laughs> did you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, just because you've dropped out, mate, that's <laughs> it. Yeah. I don't mind giving it to you, for especially when they're as good as you. Uh, yeah. So you replaced me there, England. Um, everybody, Simo keeps winding me up that you're going to take my number 11 shirt as well, but you tweeted quite famously on Rugby M radio show, Mad Monday, that you can't wait for Kevin Sinfield yeah. to leave so you can take his 13 shirt. Mate, I, that, that's a punishment, in it? But I had to delete that. Some of, some of the comments and retweets I was getting off that were just, just pretty insane, mate. I had, to, I had to get that off straight away. Um, <laughs> but... Yeah, I'd, I'd, they should probably retire that number, mate. It's it's going to be tough for someone to take Kev's Kev's mantle on and, and and do what he's done. But whatever I get, mate, I'm happy with 14th at minute. To be honest, me and that boy used to compete, and I, I think to myself, now there's no point even competing with him because you're killing it. I think personally, you and Cuthbertson could be on for for player of the year. Who's 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 your inspiration when you was growing up? Who did you look up to? Uh, well, obviously there's you, mate. There's you there. <laughs> there's you there. There's uh, <laughs> there's Kev. <laughs> mate, there's, there's a. I mean, look. You look at JP now, and what he's done and what yeah, he's still doing. Yeah. You. I mean, you probably think every week. You know what, what he does in training, what he does in in games. He's he's one of them. What 
what people need to take after. If, if Leeds are going to win anything in the future, JP is one of them people where you, you, you need to look at look at him and see what he's done and, and how he how he leads the team and how he stays in the game. You know, and there's people there's people who do it in that team stuff, but he's probably one of the top people that you know, along with care of yourself and people that have been around there for for ages. You know, that's that's what we need to do and and, and to to be you know to be a, a bit of a bit of a soldier on the field. You know, because it's, it's tough at times and and he sticks it out. Top man, Steve. You've been a legend. It's always good fun. Some nice poses as well coming out. So. We'll let you get dressed up now and uh, we'll crack on with the rest of the day. It's red hot outside, isn't it? Sweet, mate. Yeah, I'll have to get my glasses back up. 30 odd degrees. Now. Right now, Steve, we're going to jump back to Alex Simmons at Ryan Hall's old stomping ground, the Oakland Raiders, for another little league.